Hey, hello, Mr. Store. I'm making this video. Uh, I was looking at the images. I, I, th <laughs> I think you are you are going to overkill with this build. Uh, I think uh, I already mentioned that the only thing you gotta do here just fill fill in the gaps with solder and uh, you use a, a jumper wire. I think that's fine. I mean, it's nothing wrong with that. You just wanna be sure 100% that the contact they will be 100% uh, secure. That, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, here on this area the only thing you gotta do is just fill in with solder because after you uh, place solder here it's going to be in contact with the coil and this is the feedback for the r6 so that's it just apply a little bit uh, also here apply a little bit of solder and that's it that's all you need to do so don't go crazy with the jumpers because i see that you do it was not really necessary the only thing you gotta do is just fill in the the it's fine just leave it like that i mean continue doing the same way just finish the other stuff uh also here the only thing you gotta do you can actually place a jumper if you want to you, you can place a jumper or just fill in just fill in the gaps that's it with solder and that's it so they go the solder will go through and this is perfect this is perfect right here oh that looks really nice that looks really nice and this is perfect also this one here is fine this is too overkill, but it's okay. I mean, it's your board. You, you want to do it that way, it's fine. So here, like I say, just fill in with some solder, and that's it. That's it. But other than that, it looks amazing, bro. It looks really nice. I like the way it looks. Everything really... This, this is perfect. This is perfect. But I think you do solder better than I, I do. <laughs> All right, man. That's it. I just wanted to make a micro video about it. All right, man. Have a good day.